everybody, it is Arcanize here. Welcome back to another video on my channel. Hopefully you're all having an amazing day or night. Today what I'm going to be doing is reviewing Legends of Tomorrow Season 4 Episode 2 titled Witch Hunt. Now Legends has been doing very good this year and I am super impressed so far. Like they are hanging in there with Titans for me. Like, they're not as good, but I've been very impressed with Titans this year. Again, I thought it was going to be good, and they are delivering so far because this episode is very good. There are a couple things that I would criticize, but not many because this show is just quickly becoming one of my favorite on television. It's so fun. And that is really what this episode focuses on again. It is super fun and very enjoyable to just sit back and relax. Like, I love all the characters, especially John Constantine. He has to be my favorite legend right now. Like, he, he's really good. I am loving Constantine, and I think he fits so well on the legend. Sarah is great. Zari is having some pretty solid development. I just don't want them to go too far with pushing her kind of whole, you know, thing with her mom and how now she wants to make sure nothing like that ever happens again. It, it's good and it works for a character. I just don't want them to go too far with it. Also, Nate is really getting some development this season. Much needed development, may I add. And I do like him working with Ava at the Time Bureau. And I think if they stick with that, that could work. Because I wasn't really sure what they were going to do with him this season with Amaya off the team. And him working at the Time Bureau and working with his dad will be pretty interesting. I do like that they're trying to strengthen his relationship with his dad as well. I think that is going to work very well. Overall, this episode is very fun. My only thing, really, is I don't absolutely love the mythical creature villain. I prefer when they're actually fixing time anachronisms. Like, I think that, to me, is more interesting. But the, the fugitives, the mythological creatures, are pretty cool, too. Like, I enjoy the witch in this episode as a villain. The actor was very good, and her powers were fun. Maybe they went a little overboard with it. I don't know, but I enjoyed it overall. I enjoyed this entire episode. And, yeah, that I'm going to try and keep this review shorter, guys, just because... I have stuff to do. I know you guys have stuff to do. So that is going to really be it. This episode was very fun with some nice action. And the villain was solid. Wasn't amazing, but I enjoyed the witch. And she served her purpose, definitely. I like where they're going with the characters. Constantine is just straight up amazing. And Legends is just very good. Like... I am really liking it. This episode was really good, so I am going to give it an 8.8 .8 out of 10. Hopefully, you guys all enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to drop a like and subscribe down below for more videos. And I will see you all next time. Peace out.